Welcome viewers to another one of our Trans-Tasman League games. And yes, I have fixed the spelling mistake in the title. I'll let you figure out what that was. Uh, okay, this round we have uh, Andrew. Uh, Andrew from Melbourne here against uh, John from uh, Kiwiland. So yeah, this is definitely a Trans-Tasman League. We have, you know, I don't know who to follow here because I kind of like both these lists, but Almighty Starhawk, he's, he's another Victorian. I think I kind of have to kind of have to root for the home team here but uh anyway let's have a bit of fun let's see what we got so andrew here he is flying himself a starhawk battle uh battleship mark one uh he's decked that thing out with amity with uh what my mothma huh i don't think you got the memo that you meant to staple agate to this ship and leave it at that but okay my mothma let's give it let's give it a try let's see what happens uh we've got the magnite uh tractor beams as well magnite Crystal Tractor Beam Array, Kaken and Sholem. That is an interesting choice. Probably took that because he's got Spinal Armament. So five red dice out the front all the time. Six of the Confire. Yeah, that's going to be a problem to deal with. Uh, we also have uh, Blissix in there as well. So he's probably pretty lonely without his missus with him. Uh, we also got Intel Officer. So, ooh, yeah, geez, six red dice and Intel Officer. That's going to be a problem. Uh, what do we got here? We got ourselves some lovely three Corvettes. So he's kind of sticking with this. Uh, each one of those. Whoops. Didn't want to highlight the ship. I want to highlight. There we go. Oh, I can actually do that. Can I? I can push Alton. Oh, there we go. There's the lovely, pretty blue Corvette. Yeah, and here we go. We got a lovely, pretty teal Corvette. And a lovely, pretty little red Corvette. Oops. Don't want to push the shields button. It'll shoot me. Little red one. Oh, yeah, that does zoom up. Huh. How do you like that? That's a little feature I didn't know we could do. What happens if I do it with the Starhawk? Oh, God, yeah, ugly. Uh, <laughs> one day the running will be done on that thing, I'm sure. So all of them are rocking the TRC Corvette. Uh, to, yeah, Turbo Laser Reroute Circuit. So get those better accuracies out of them. And he's got, uh, yeah, two of the YT2400s. So rogues, uh, having a bit of fun doing what rogues do. Black dice rogues, they're always a good thing to have. Uh, let's scroll across and see what John has bought to face off against him. Uh, he has... Oh, hello, hello. This is looking like a Radis bomb. Here we go. All right, we'll start off with Radis because Admiral Radis here, uh, having that whole fun thing, whatever he does on the Armored Cruiser. Interesting, taking the Armored Cruiser. Usually it's the um, Torpedo Cruiser, I think, is normally the one everyone takes. Uh, so on this thing here, we've got the Overload Pulse. We do have the ECMs, which is basically stabbed to everything with a... The, the uh, defensive retrofit. We have some external racks as well. It's just, it's interesting. He's got the things here, but he doesn't really have that dice modification to help him out, sadly. Uh, over on the other side, what have we got? We have Profundity. Oh, hello. Hang on. Radis. Profundity. Oh, yeah, that works because you can put this inside that. Yeah, yeah. He's tucked the hammerhead torpedo frigate, he said before, which we'll get to that in a minute, inside uh, Profundity here. Because Radis will drop Profundity, and then Profundity will drop the Hammerhead. So we've got Rax and that thing as well. We have ourselves some Rapid Launch Bays. So he's already got some fighters sitting in there. Uh, there's double W7s there as well. What have we got here? Here we go. Armored, cru armored Cruiser again. Interesting. He's taking the Armored Cruiser. Uh, moving across the side here, we have the Hammerhead Torpedo Frigate. Garel's on her. Well, if you're going to drop one with Radis, why not drop that one? Uh, also with the external racks also. So, yeah, getting close, drop those bombs and have some fun. Uh, we've got the GR-75 with Bomber Command Center. So that means he's got some bombers in here. And it's looking like, oh, here we go. we got Luke Skywalker. Just roll on the one black. Discard the shields. We don't care about shields. Uh, we have Nora. So Nora's, uh, Nora doesn't really pair well with Luke, I suppose, does it? I suppose you can put the damage... Oh, yeah, I suppose you still... The critical effect you resolve is that. If you get hit, create, and then you put two damage cards under the shield. That's probably not too bad, actually. That's, that'd be annoying for your opponent to work out. Uh, Kian Falander. While attacking a ship, if the defending holds and has no shields, you may reroll any number of dice in your pool. I don't see him a lot, but by God, he nearly tripped me up the other day. Uh, yeah, so he's got the squadrons and that. Uh, tucked inside Profundi. And we have deployed Radis and the Bomber Command Center. So... Yeah, it seems like a bit of an interesting list there. Uh, I'm not too sure what to make of it, really. This looks like it could be could be a lot of fun. Uh, the objective they are playing is... Let me bring it up for you guys so you can see it. Transition. There we go. Targeting beacons. Yay. So, yeah, they're playing that today. I'm going to flick it back over to game chat so you guys can hear. And, uh, yeah, hope you enjoy. Alrighty, guys, I got your recording now. Cool. Put on a good show. Oh, we're on the big. 
Big time. Yes, let's play that. Have that play for the next one and a half hours, two hours. Let us see how sane we still are. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I've been. Have you been listening to the music we've been posting in the Discord? <laughs> some of those, some of those songs. No, I haven't. Yeah, they're actually really good. Actually, some people have really put together the the soundtracks, and they've like one guy. He's actually gone and embellished on it and added some more stuff to it. It's actually pretty interesting to listen to. If we didn't get a copyright strike, I'd play it over the videos. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, so was it just a different Star Wars background music and stuff, is it? Oh, uh, no. It's like you take... Um, like, I've been listening to some of the Rebels themed one lately. Like, they, he takes, like, a lot of the Rebels themes, mashes them together, um, like, uh, mashes them all together, then he adds, like, more music to it. Um, like, oh, okay. more, it kind of, kind of blends it a bit. DJ's adds some other, like, uh, some of his own instruments and playing all... I think he does anyway, and that's... Yeah, it comes out pretty good, actually. Mm. Yeah. Links are in the Discord. <laughs> <laughs> have we got an updated um, score sheet? I mean, I've only played two games, but I'm guessing some people are ploughing through their games at the moment. Yeah, Alex, Alexi's nearly done. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, I'll update one on Sunday. There haven't been that many games this week, so I'll update it again on Sunday. Cool. Yeah. I was going to say, Alexi has to save one of his one of his league games for me, actually, but <laughs> I was wanting to play him in a league game as well, but... Mm, I've, I've only played two so far. I've both been losses, but I've managed to kill a Starhawk in one and an MC-75 in the other, so at least they weren't complete wastes of time. There's <laughs> <laughs> hey, one with a double every... Starhawk list. <laughs> yeah, I know. That guy's a real prick, wasn't he? <laughs> <laughs> uh, now, we're up to the objective thing. Um, yep. So we get four um, tokens, and we start with the second alternate placing one starting with the second player. Okay, right. One, two, three, four. It's in the setup here, isn't it, I think. Is there any range restrictions or anything? Uh, basically, after placing obstacles, the players alternate placing a total of four objective tokens in the setup area. Yeah. With the second player. So as long as they're in within yep. you know, three and five or whatever. Because what's the special rule? Well, one of the second player ships is attacking a ship that is at distance one to two an objective token attacker may reroll up to two attack dice in the attack pool. Right, so it has no benefit to you whatsoever. Right, oh, right. okay, so let's put one... What speed was your Starhawk doing? It's doing one. All oh, right, okay, so I'm going to land about there. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we'll lock that. Right, your next one. Uh, so that, yeah, that's your first one. I put one over here, so now it's your next one. Of course you did. <laughs> <laughs> the good old, I'll place my two tokens out of the play area where they're no longer relevant. It's almost the case of that, why even give your opponent a place to put tokens? <laughs> yeah. It's kind of um, silly, really. Yeah, because what's even sillier is I just do this, right? Basically. Chocolate. They basically sit on top of each other. I just stack them. Just say. Just well, at the end of the day, I as long, I you only need one. Them, you, you can actually put them beyond that dotted line, Andrew. They actually go further out to the next line. That dotted line is when you want to give play them ideas. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right. It's as far away from where he's gonna rat us in that doesn't matter. Yeah, just to annoy you, I'm going to avoid the star hook now. Go after those CR90s just to piss you off. <laughs> Do, it. Uh, Do it! Do it! Do it! Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, no, I didn't, no, I didn't see the speed. Right. Um, good luck, and. Good luck, mate. We're off. May the best uh, Rebel Civil War captain win. That's it. So it's, it's basically the fish monster versus the, yeah, the chick in the white dress. Mmm. All right, um, let's uh, bid us some dollars. Hey, what do you reckon? Yeah, well, I've done mine, so okay. at least one half of the Rebel Alliance is organised. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're doing surprise attack. What? You actually want us to go and fight? Um, okay. Uh, I'm starting to wonder, looking at targeting big ends, if it should have been just, I get, you know, first, second player gets to place two tokens and then make it at distance one to three of one of those tokens. Then you probably see it more. Yeah. For real. Yeah. yeah. 
I suppose it's probably a better objective when you're playing a bigger points value. When you've got more ships spread out, the, op the opponent's going to put them obviously far away, but if there's more ships on the table, you're covering more area, the more chance that more of the tokens will come into effect. Yes, I suppose. Good area there, though. They're up to one to two, is it? Uh, yeah, I one think it two. Yeah, of the yeah. Um, beacon. And so they're still pretty good. They're gonna, they're gonna. It's not too yeah, bad. It's, yeah. it's even better if you, I suppose the trouble is if you had a board the squadrons with strategic. That's the trouble. I see a lot yeah. of people playing this one, but they don't bring strategic squadrons with them to get the real benefit of those tokens. Yeah. 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 If you had that, then yeah, that would make them. If, especially then, if it was one to three, make them a nightmare. It's probably strategic is the reason why they're one to two. Because mm. yeah. effectively, I've got. That sort of area to to, to engage you in, and, oh, and there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that could be quite telling, actually, because the Starhawk really isn't going to go away from them. No. He's just getting a couple of good, good rerolls. All right. Um, shall we kick it off? Yeah. Okay, Make sure you well, shuffle your damage stick. Oh, yeah. Let's do that. Done. All right. So let's go with green. Um, which is navigate. Oh, here I was. Thought, thought you were running away. Um, so I'm increasing the speed three, as you can see there. I mean, if those things get close enough to me before I've dropped my Starhawk, um, or Starhawk, my um, MC-75, I'm tempted just to drop it in the middle of the three of them and blast those to pieces instead. <laughs> 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 uh, I'm okay with that. That's, um, I know. <laughs> I mean, it'd be satisfying, but I know it's not going to win me the game. Because <laughs> what are they worth? 41, oh, 44, so, yeah, 51 points each. So even if I kill three of them, that's 150 odd points. That's the Starhawk on its own. <laughs> Um, your two squadrons. Oh, yeah, we didn't deploy them. Apologies. <laughs> I was about to say, I was just looking to do you have rapid launch bays? <laughs> um, look, I didn't need you. Um, where, look, I'll tell you what, where do you want to put them? Put them wherever. Oh, no, 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 you just deploy them where you would have put them anyway. I, I hadn't even thought about it. Because otherwise I'm going to say put them all the way the side. forgot about them. Um, yeah, halfway through the game and all of a sudden these two squadrons appear. <laughs> We'll oh, yeah, empty. We'll plant them there because it's kind of puppy, to be honest. They're just um, hedging their bets. Oh, so you've got the, the crystal tractor array thingy. Yeah. This one, uh, uh, uh. Yeah, strategic would have been like if I had a. Uh, yeah, I'm crazy. Yeah, that'd be very interesting, wouldn't it? Just push them Sorry. away. Yeah. Right, anyway. So, oh, you've moved him. Yeah, right. Uh, right, the GR75 activate. A maneuver. And I'll. What am I doing? Speed 2. I'll just bank the token for that for now. Two. Done. Right. Got it. Yep. Okay. Uh, red. There we go. Thank you. 
end of your activation. Is it distance 1 to 5 for the tractor beam, is it? Yeah. So it is increased or decreased to your speed. Right, okay, cool. Right. My next one mm -hmm. is a manoeuvre. And I will bank a token. Yep. So, was I doing speed three? One, two. Okay. Let's just go straight ahead. There you go. Blue. Doesn't really matter which way I do these now. Um, same deal, make a three. Imagine if somebody just turns up and paints their tabletop, their um, armada ships, like just a basic one colour, and go, why paint it like that? Oh, it's like tabletop simulator. <laughs> paint the star hall for a basic white. white. Yeah. Familiar to me. I'm tempted to repaint mine, just the bits of the yellow. I don't like the paint job it came with. Really? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, it's nice, but I just don't like it. I mean, I've seen one that was on the I'm out of forums. There was one that was done with a dark blue, and uh, but there, or was it red and a bit of dark blue or something? It looked actually looked really good. It looked like a proper Rebel Alliance one rather than a um, uh, what do you call it? Repu uh, is it not Republic? Um, yeah, that one. Well, Resistance or whatever the um, the actual. Yeah, I wouldn't know. I, yeah. I haven't really got into any of those other spin-offs other than no. whatever Disney's pumped out. <laughs> Oh, it wasn't so much that, but um, it's got the New Republic's logo on it. It's not the um, Rebel Alliance logo or whatever it is, but anyway. Um, squadrons. Um... Yeah, I do like those being rogue. Yeah. Um, they might actually almost put you in attack range. <laughs> yeah, well, they don't quite actually, so I'm just looking at. Um, you've got blue flak, right? Uh, a blue and black. Blue and black, alright. Don't see, move away. <laughs> Remember, I've got rerolls. <laughs> Actually, is it rerolls against ships? Or... So Second pilot ship attacking a ship. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's oblivious to the whole thing. Going to grab a glass of water. I'll be back in a bit. Ten seconds. <laughs> Thank you, Dave. Come back. Sorry? 
come back. So that's the end of the right. turn. Yep. Everything done. We'll move that to there. Flip it. Right, and back to command dials. Uh, right, okay. Right. All good to go? Yep. Oh, you need... No, you need another one on your Starhawk. Oh, I did too. Sorry. <laughs> yep. Apologies. It's going to catch up with me eventually, wasn't it? Um... Okay. Oh, right, you're done. Right, okay. GR75. Uh, okay. Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> um, so, the green CR90. Mm -hmm. That is Con5. Oh, that's right, you're first. Duh. Yeah. Oh, I'm being stupid. Yeah, let me put that back on there. <laughs> okay. He's going next. Um, okay, so we've got We've got side to front and front to front or side. So I'll do a I'll do I'll start out the front and I'll go my front to your front and grab two reds. All right, so my front to your front. There's no obstructions, it's too red. Um, and we've got link turbo lasers if I want to use them. All right, okay, we've got hit and accuracy. Oh, sorry, there's a flip, it's hit and accuracy. Where have we gone? Sorry, I should be selected those. No, there you go. E, I think it is. E flips it to whatever you want to hit and an accuracy. There you go. Hit. There you go. Cool. All right. So, what tokens has he got? He's got uh, those ones. Uh, two abrasive redirects. Um, so, I may as well confire in the red. So, delete that. Um, I'll grab another red. Roll it. I'm sorry, the roll is a flick. <laughs> and shit, it really does. All right, so what I'm going to do is green. We're going to burn that. We're going to flick that. And we're going to convert that to a double hit. Right. How expected. Okay, seven, six, five, four, three. There we go, three. Alright, so, and I'll accuracy the brace. Okie dokie. Three damage. That's on the... Front. On the front. Right. I'll use the redirect. Yep. Let's go... Does it three, so we'll go... One on the front, yeah. and then two on the side. Okay. And the last is um, out the side to the front for one red yep. light. Ha. Of course it is. Uh, right. Burning all my defense tokens. 
moment. Uh, no, let's just go take the pain and go two on the front. Okay. All right. And he's doing speed three. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. <sighs> you like out the side there? No. No, just good for it. Yeah, just be a little bit visual, this will hurt. But... Yeah, um... Well, technically, I do. Oh, yeah, if you use your. Um... Use your ordinance experts, whatever your extra thing is. External racks, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, what the hell? Can you give me something to think about? At least you're not near a targeting beacon. <laughs> <laughs> Yet. <laughs> Right, GR seventy five this time. He's got a maneuver command. So he is doing speed two at the moment. Yep. Uh, let's go. Slow it down to speed one using the command dial. Mm -hmm. One, two, Go. Your turn. Okay, red dude. He's got to navigate. Staying at speed three. Um, I, had, I said I was going to burn it, so I didn't take it as a token. Well, burn it anyway. Um, no problem. Right, my one is it? Mm -hmm. Right, I suppose we'll do some shooty. Oh, I'll reveal my command first. Mm -hmm. Navigate. Yep. Right, let's do some shooty shooty first. Um, right. Oh, you in, in short, which is actually useful for you. Yeah, do I want to use more. bikes? Just, just, if you know what Oh, you right, know. yes, yes, of course. Um, I'm just thinking, do I want to use external ranks? I don't think I do. Uh, so your first attack pool will be obstructed. Yeah. So anyway, so we'll have... Was it three red, two blue? So I'm probably going to drop a red, I think. So I'll do two red and two blue. 
and into what is that side to front um side to side? i suppose it doesn't really matter you could if i go side you can direct it to the rear if you go front you know yeah i'll go i'll go side to side there is actually a difference i just want to point out if, if you're doing being it completely arbitrary it'd be nice it makes a difference um whether you go side to front or side to side I'll let you just understand that it's more than just the shield but i'll let you have a think about it well they're both going to be obstructed yeah oh the range yeah, no, it'd be the front then. Of course, you have sides at medium range, yeah. Because if it was, um, if you went side to side, um, I would be able to cancel a dice. If you go side to front, I have to re-roll. Yeah. Right, anyway, let's, uh, let's give this a whirl. Um, can I do anything with that? I don't think I can. Cool. I can do overload pulse and exhaust all your um, fence tokens, mm -hmm. which I suppose I will. So that's at the end after I sp that's after I spin tokens. Yep. Sorry. Oh, and I've got accuracy there as well. What have you got? That's on the green one. I'll oh, accuracy your green evade. All right. So I will just. Um redirect um, those to my right. Cool. I don't think there's anything else I can do. So that will exhaust your other defense token. Then you're going to put the crit to the exhaust. Yep. So it flips it. Uh, yep. Right. That, that. Do that. I don't think I've got any other shots anywhere else. I suppose it's now movement. So I'm doing speed three at the moment. Let's turn that off. One, two, three. Navigate tokens. Let's go. One. Use that for my token. Your token can't use it for your. Ah, you, uh, not token. Station. Sorry, my my command oh, yeah, file. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Uh, not the token. Yeah. Uh, that one there. That will be a one. I think that's all I'll do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right. Go. Done. Right. Uh, okay, so uh, activate blue. Hopefully, I didn't shimmy into your, your range. I don't think I did, but. Not too far off, though. <laughs> so, uh, right, I'm currently doing speed three. I've got a navigate dial. Hmm, it's going a bit too quick. Um, That's probably not a great um, <laughs> area to win. Yeah, but, but to be honest, um, it's kind of like I'm breaking the debris field, taking a couple of shields, but otherwise I go screaming up the board as you go. Go, oh, bye. <laughs> <laughs> It's a bit of a we'll hit the brakes, you'll fly right by. Um, what if I go so I've used my navigate there, still in trouble. Um, I'll do that, yeah, that works. Crazy as that is. Um, let's go on those two shields. Oh, okay, yeah, accelerating up the speed four. <laughs> yeah, I think. Yeah, I'm going to go blowing through the other side. That's all right. Choices. Choices. All right. I think um, you'll hit your ship there, but it should be good. 
Um, all right, that's kind of that's the crazy ass sort of shit that Corvettes do. Um, all right, let's do it. Let's do it. Who does wins? Yeah, it didn't pick. Yep. Cool. That's insane. It's almost an intergalactic fender bender, but okay. Yeah. All right, I mean, you're a big boy. The big boy. All right, what's the range now? Please tell me you're still out of range. <laughs> oh, <yeah>. Yes. <laughs> One more turn to safety. Um, <clears throat> right, so the top dial is on fire. Uh, there's absolutely nothing in range. So we take that as a token. To the list. It's on fire. Uh, burn that. Go beautifully within token range and probably throw the main light. That's how it works. Make sure. Yep, it's nothing there. So, um, let's get rid of that. So, the magnet reads At the end of your activation, you may exhaust this card to choose one enemy ship at distance one to five. That ship's speed is increased or decreased to match your speed. You, While well, your speed is zero, you cannot ready this card. So, I've just magnet track the beam due. Okay, and which ship are you choosing? And I'm assuming I'm going to one. The MC75, yeah? Yep, okay, so, so that drops the speed. One. one. Where are we? Where are we? Where are we? That one, yeah. Uh, How rude. Um, so that's the end Here. And grab a black. No rerolls. No, nope, not a bomber. For one into your side. Into your side there. One. Oh, sorry. Yep. Um. Into your um, left shield. Uh, I suppose I have to wear that. Yep. And to the front. Nothing. Okay, um, that is the end of turn two. Okay, right. Uh, down three. All right, the turn of reckoning, eh? Right. Bourbon chain was just yelling out to me. <laughs> uh, right. Sorry. Oh no, she, 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 gets, she gets up quite early for her for work in the morning. She was just yelling out to me. She didn't think the door was locked. It's like yes, it is. <laughs> Scared the boogie man off. Yeah. Um. Right. So I'll do dials. I'll do, uh, decide whether I. Oh yes, and do my dials and decide whether I do Radis and the other nastiness. Sure. You're going to want that there. Let's do there. Okay. Right, 
So now, obviously, Radius is range 1 to 2 now. Um, what's... Ideally, we want to get around the back, but hell, that's not going to happen, is it? Not at the speed now. I'm thinking I'm... Uh, shit. Can't avoid your front arc, I don't really. Oh, what's your side arc? Five dice. Now, what the hell? Let's do it. Every other game I've done with this, I've waited till about turn three, sometimes turn four, and by then I've lost most of the effect of my bloody ship okay. being able to really help out. I've usually lost my other ship by then, so. Range two there. Actually, get that a little bit closer and stay out of your arc. So, try and double arc here a bit. Mm -hmm. Does. Where are we? One, two, yep, okay. It's there. That. Why can't I pick it up? Oh, because I bloody um did the range thing, he didn't. Right, yep, yeah, that'll do. Right, so deploy that one, and then I'll do the hammerhead corvette at the same time. Yep. Of course, that's going to be range one of this ship, so hang on, we'll turn this one off, tidy that up a bit. That, oh, no, wrong one. That one. Never know. The... Although, you're going to activate first, I assume. Move. You're doing speed one. Nah, should be okay. I don't want to get too far close in front of my ship, because otherwise it's going to crash into myself. <laughs> right, so I'll just set orders for these, and then we're good to go. Uh, right, okay, so... First one needs to be... There... There and oh, actually, that one, that, yeah, that one's right. And hammerhead, probably guess what that one will be, but. Let's do that, and I'm going to set their speeds. Uh, Hammerhead will do speed... 2. And the other MC-75 will do speed 1. There we go. Yep. Right, we should be all good to go now. So that's doing speed 2, that's doing speed 1? Yep. Okay. Okay, um, right, so, um, the big guy, yeah, mm, yeah. You can shoot the transport. <laughs> yeah. You know what, thank you, I, I completely missed that. I mean, it's a big three. He's got Bomber Command Center. You, you, wow. you don't want that going off. <laughs> Jeez, you're, you're right. Oh, thank you for giving me that clarity. I don't get told that very often. Could you say it again so I could record it? <laughs> yeah. Yep. 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 It will go under sarcastic comments made on Tabletop Simulator. Yes, from an Australian to a New Zealander. Who would have ever thought it? Yeah, that's right. All right. I'm trying to roll my... um. Oh, that's not going to work, is it? All right, confide. Yeah. 
Okay. That, that's unexpected. Unexpected. All right. Um, there's a dot. There's a token over here as well. So I have to give you okay. Here, though. Um. So out the front is sort of uncontested as to what I do. Be sure. I don't think there's any. So uh, yeah. So it's really into the yellow. MC75 into the front arc. All right. So initially, with spinal arm, that's five red dice front to yep. front. Okay. Um, <coughs> and there's the option for confi. So let's build a pool. One, two, three, four, five. And possibly one more. Oh, you've won over there already. All right. Okay. Um, right, let's do this. Time to dispense justice. Dispense Joe. <laughs> oh, yeah. That, that looks pretty justice to me. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I, I can live with yeah, that sort of justice. justice to me. All right. Um, uh, right. All right, let's put that like that. Oh, that there at the moment. So we're dealing with three. Um, what's this guy got? He's got everything available to him. Um, all right, we're going to go for maximum pain. We're going to burn the dial now and grab the extra red. Yep. And uh, before we do this, because after rolling your initial attack pool, I am going to. Intel officer the brace. Attacking after you roll your attack pool, you may also card choose one to fit. So it's, oh, right. So if I spin it, it's um, discarded, Burn, right? If you, yeah, so basically full discard if you use the brace. To I, okay, yes, ECM won't, won't help me with that. Well, it is oh, also, yeah, yeah, it yeah. won't give you, know, yeah, it's, yep. not, it's not an accuracy attack. It's a, yep. yeah, no, no, that's cool. Right, okay, so you've got three at the moment. So I've grabbed this extra dice, which is yes. my... Concentrate fire, yep. On fire roll. So I'll put up here in case it's a dud. It's not. Okay, um, yep. You've got, a, you've, got a, you've got a basically a, a, a ECM, so let's just treat it as a dud. <laughs> okay, yep. Um, and now I'm going to burn Kaitan and Sholin. And re-roll the other two, I'm guessing. Which is basically, while attacking, you may exhaust this card to re-roll any number of dice of one colour. Yep. So we'll burn that, and now we'll grab those three up the top. I could, I could, I could lock your brace with that, and then you have to ease in that. Uh, and burn it, and we're still taking three versus putting it into the good shield. Uh, yeah, let's, let's just roll it all. Rolling all of them, okay. That's what we want. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yep. And it is basically a Intel officer on the brace. Yep. Well, if I don't t brace it and I redirect it, what am I going to be taking? We've got three, four, three on the hull. Which you can contain. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I want to discard the brace this early. I mean, if the brace was already exhausted, then obviously I wouldn't hesitate because hell, I'm going to use it anyway and lose it. Um, I'm thinking I will just redirect. Okay. Yeah, redirect. Okay. Right, so we'll flip that. Oh, and contain, obviously. Right, so... Obviously, one on the front shield and deplete that completely. Um, the other three on there, deplete this, so that's four, and then three on the hull. These guys are what, nine? Three? Yeah, three, yeah, three on the hull, yep. Yeah. Yeah. 
If you, yeah, if you absorb four, it's three in the hole. Yep. And he's got six left, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, the second shot is uh, out the side. Yep. And I think I'm going to go the hammerhead. Okay, yep. More chance of popping us, I suppose. More chance. We're certainly making it bleed a lot. So we've got um, two red, uh, two blue, and a black. Okay, and there are no mods for this. Uh, uh, I don't think there's anything you can do with it. No, nah, two reds, two blues, and a black. It is what it is. Is that? Didn't get an accuracy. Four, five, six. No accuracies. And these guys don't have a brace, do they? Uh, no. So. so. Let's go redirect to start with. And. Contain? Yeah, and contain. Was there, was there a critical there? Yep. yep. So, six. So, two on the front, so it's two. One on the side, that's three. No, no, none face up because you can contain, yeah? So, you yep. can take three face down. One, two, three. Well, I was say this this turn has not been as bad as I thought it might have been. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna now burn my navigate token. Okay. Oh, yep. Two. So I have to speed. Two. Two. Yep. Run away from the puny little hammerhead. That's it. Um. I do. And I'm Still going to double act, yeah. uh, magnite the red. This guy's going to speed what one? Yes. So I'm going to red him, magnite him. To speed, speed two. two. Okie dokie. Uh, there. Two. That's okay, well he's moved now, so now I can sort of work out what I want to activate first. So I can activate the Radist ship, because he wasn't the first one to activate the round. Who am I going to activate first though? Because he's going two. Um, I should get the hammer hit out of the way first. Although, actually no, I'll do... So he's doing speed one. Let's activate the yellow um, MC-75. Mm -hmm. Concentrate fire. Only out the side at medium range. Yep. So what have we got? Three red, two blue. That. Want red. And concentrate fire. Now, what have I got on the overload pulse? So let's go. So this is out. Sorry, this is that inside you got. Yeah, it's out my side arc. Yep. yep. Into yep. your front arc. Yep. Into side to front. Concentrate fire. Yep. The um, uh, a blue dice. Yep. Now, am I in? Uh, was it range one to two for the beacons? Isn't it? Yep. You got rerolls definitely. Uh, yeah, cool. Either beacon would re -roll there. Sorry? Either of your beacons would work there, I'd say. Mm. Right, uh, let's roll this. Looks like I might need that re-roll. <laughs> yeah. Oops. Oh, it's still... Right. It's yeah. Yeah. Wait. Right, and re-roll those. Ah! There's a lot of criticals there. If this was X-Wing, that'd be a brilliant roll. Oops. Where was it? There we go. Three, three, four, five. Five. So, 
yeah, I suppose I overload pulse you. Right. So before you overload pulse me, uh, I will brace and redirect. <laughs> yep. So, At least the overload pulse doesn't then discard those because there is this. Yeah, that's right. It just, just yeah, clears the thing. And I'll also then salvo you. Because so why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you? This was about to. Uh, so that's going to be. So salvo attack because there's a black dice in there. So I, I haven't used this much. Can you hit me with the black dice because it's at medium range? No. So it's only whatever's in range you can do. The two reds, yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Um, so at this point, I've salvoed, redirected, braced, and there's five there, isn't there? Five, yeah. Yeah, so I'll evade as well. <laughs> so make me re-roll one, is it? So what that does is because we're at medium range and it's my Mothma. Oh, no. I can actually, it, 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 I can actually yeah. get rid of one of those. Right, so I'll get rid of that one. So now it's four. Yep. I brace that to two and I redirect two to the left shield. Yep. Which turns that to two. And then I salvo and you hit me from the side. Yep. So it's just two red unmodified back into your side. Okay. No mods, no rerolls. Or one. One. Your side. Yeah, just take a damage card. Right, my second attack. Um, who am I going to attack here? Close range on the blue one, I think. Yep. Yeah, because that's obstructed, so I might as well do that. Three red and two blue. Yeah, there's no point flacking at the moment. Out the way. Right. Um, um, no, it's three and there's two accuracies there. So it's on the blue one. It's mm -hmm. whether we're at short range. So, um, it's front shield two, and I've got what three. It's accuracy, um, redirect, and accuracy one evade, I suppose. The redirect and the evade. And goal. So um, yeah, I, I will... won't. I won't overload pulse. Um. Yep. This time. Cool. All right. So. Uh, is that, do you exhaust that when you do that? Is the overload pulse, it doesn't say to, oh, uh, no, oh, it just says exhaust all the defenders' defense tokens. No, you don't exhaust the card too. Okay. No. No. Um, no, I think, I think the um, only one does that is the um, Iron Cannon one. Yeah. So you've locked down a... One uh, evade and a redirect, yep. So I will flip the other one. Yep. Um, Make me re-roll one. I'll let you... Actually, do I really want to do that, actually? Um, they're gone. That is a... That's a crit. That is a crit, um, crit, and a hit. So, I would have to... I may as well... Um, re-roll the red crit, I reckon. Reroll the red crit. Otherwise, I'm going to take a crit because I can't. Have, I can't. I'm going to take three if I don't reroll the red crit. Yep. Reroll the red crit, please. Okay. To a hit. That's a better outcome. All right. So I just take one damage card instead of taking a crit, which is good. All right. So well, how come I still got the blue crit there? Because I didn't use overload uh, bolts. True. I didn't avoid that, did I? No. You. That's right. All right. So yeah. On the front. That's why I didn't do it because I knew I'd be have nothing else shooting you this turn, so there's no point right. exhausting all your defense tokens. Yeah, well, well spotted. All right, for that, um, it is 
damage munitions when attacking a ship before you roll your attack, remove one die of your choice. Okay, right. That's pretty handy. For you, not me. Um, all right. Okay. Well, we can put a range, so I guess we'll hold it over. All right, cool. All right, anyway, it's that to attack, so movement. So I'm doing speed one. Where's that asteroid there? Uh, I think I'm clear of it. Just. Oh, hang on. I'll just go and do so you can grab yeah, that. Maybe. Oops. Uh, move. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Um, a conga move. line going here. Yeah. Move that there. Think. It's always hard to get them in next to it. When you hold the left mouse button to lift, pick it up, if you hold the right one as well, it'll drag it along the table and you can sort of move it up against it. I've got an Apple mouse. Oh, <laughs> right. I've got one thing. An Apple mouse, right. Yes, I'm used to back here. How do I do it with one button? That's foreign to me. <laughs> it's weird. Honestly, it's not really designed for TTS. It, it took me the first couple of games, I was all over the place. Just Clicking things like, you um, shouldn't be. And... Basic things like Zoom, and I was 30 feet away from the table. It was hopeless. But you need the hang of it now, I'm assuming. I think so. I hope so. Right. Right, so that was that was yellow. Yep. Um, right. Your second ship. <laughs> Interesting times. Um, I wonder. That. This is going to be really interesting, actually, because um, you've now lost the ability, lost the dice. Range. Um, he's unobstructed as far as I can tell. Draw a line. Hang on, uh, no, it's unobstructed at least you count the squadron. Okay. Um, but, um, and he's medium range, so he still has a red and a blue. And that's it. Um, why don't we do that? Just keep him out of the way. We get where we need to fly. Um, <laughs> At least you're shooting the one she uh, one hole that's still got shields. Yeah, not for long, I don't think. <laughs> um, okay, so he's got a confire. Yep. He uh, is crippled with a whatever that card says it says. Um, damage munitions. Remove a dice. Uh, right, so let's remove a red. Let's get ourselves a red and a blue. Get rid of these range rings that upset dice. Oh, that's right, yeah, because you've got to remove a, a dice for your thing. Yeah. Um, and what are you adding up here? Concentrate fire. Front to back, and then come fire to come. And there's no, there's no side shot because it's obstructed. Anyway, and it's mm -hmm. range. Oh, it might be just in range, but um, it goes to zero. Or yeah, you are in range, but yeah, yeah, you got two dots. Dots. So it's just yeah, um, those two and con fire is available, which I'm gonna kind of definitely add in just for services, right? So at the moment, one fire in a red. Um, and don't need to use link to the lasers when they roll like that. Um, and I am going to can I'm going to basically still get your ECM. Um, so yeah, I got three. 
hear you that. You I contain your brace, you lose the emmet. Um well maybe just force you to lose the emmet. And other than that, um do your container, it doesn't get through the shield anyway. Alright, we will um accuracy the um the brace. Just Okie dokie. Yeah, well, I'll ECM it. Yeah. And I'll still use it, brace it down to two, and take it on the shields. Cool. Because I don't have any other option. No. No. I'm beginning to think I should have used my external racks on that um, green Corvette now, because I don't know if I'm going to get a chance to get it off, actually. Depending on how this next turn goes. Um, Alright, so this guy now needs to move, I think, three he's going at. Four. Oh, he's on fire. Um, I think I was potentially going to turn into a kamikaze. I don't think you can get that. <laughs> Smash straight into the Starhawk. <laughs> the Starhawk. Um, you know, bullying tactics, you know, turning a, um, basically turning a um, Corvette into a hammerhead. Um, There's only room enough for one hammerhead on this table. Yeah. <laughs> It's not, it's not in the union contracts there. <laughs> Do not ram. Uh, yeah, okay, that's going to keep it outside range to eight and outside close. And you're just generally being annoying, I think. No, no, I can't do that. So leave Do that. All right, um, over to Team Team Pop Out. Team Pop Out. <laughs> All right, um, who do I do next? I suppose he's doing speed one, so it should be We're safe. Speed two now. So who? The red dude's doing speed two now. Oh, that's right, you speed me up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, right, so. I don't know if I've got enough manoeuvre space here, so I might have to do my hammerhead now, actually. Right. Hammerhead Corvette has a concentrate fire dial. I'm in short range. Uh, and... I need to flip this other token, by the way, because you definitely... Um... Sorry? I need to flip my contain token because you um, uh, you, you hit me with your pulse, yeah? Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Right, okay, so we've got a red, black, and a blue out the front. Right, let's roll that to start with. Right, add in external racks. And concentrate fire of, let's do another black dice. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's still getting used to the lag on the... There we go. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> no, I was just wanted to keep it as a cheap throwaway kamikaze type ship, so... Mm -hmm. Can... Yeah. Hmm. I don't have a fire power. God. <laughs> this is a league game, you, you naughty man. <laughs> what token? I don't have a fire power token. Yeah, you don't. That's true. Yeah, so God can be quiet. <laughs> um, all right. How much? Of, right. How much of a really nice guy are we trying to be right now? Uh, all right, I'm going to help you out just this one more time. And oh, yes, yes, yes. Sorry, the, the, this is the first time playing the mission here, targeting me. No, I'm too far away from those 
targeting it's people. Not me. It's, it's not you, it's me. It's, you know, one of those things, it's not you, it's me. You know, that relationship thing. Hey? Is it if you're... Uh, it says, one of the second players is attacking distance. So, well, one of the second player ships is attacking... Oh, it's... A, oh, right. Yeah, okay. I've been reading it wrong, thinking I had to be at distance one to two of it. No. Okay, no, let's no. re-roll those then. That's a bit better. Go. Thanks, Ian. Three, four, five, six. You're <laughs> he's welcome. Saying token, he's saying token thing. I don't have a five-power token. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't think I was that stupid. <laughs> I, I am sitting here screaming at the at the stream. My wife's <laughs> look at me weird. I'm thinking, roll for the token, roll for the token. It's just like, uh -uh. ah. That was, was a hit crit. Hit, yeah. A hit and a hit crit. Yeah, yeah. So I think, well, yeah. yeah. So six damage. No accuracies. There is a critical there, though. Six damage. With a crit. Um. So, I'm going to burn the redirect and the brace. Okay. I'm guessing you got, um, was it Bliss? Uh, yeah, well, how, do you, how do you say it? Wallix, is it? Blissix or something? Yeah. Sounds I'm like assuming, medication, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm assuming he's going to come into effect um, very yeah, soon. really good for cold sores as well. <laughs> Um, all right, so um, we move that to one, this to zero, and back to you to move. Okay, I've still got my side arc as well, which is one black okay. dice. Yep. Um, right. Going into the side of the back. The rear. Yep. One damage. One. I can... No, I'll just do the one damage. I'm not going to re-roll it. Sure. Done. Move one. Right. B two. Right. Um. Two. Is he doing one or two? No, I'm doing speed two with him. Speed one's the oh, yeah. one. Yeah, you were. That's right. That's right. Yeah. Not quite close enough to hit you and do a face-up damage. Oh, you got Garrel in the back there, have you? Mm. See Garrel as well? Yeah. Yep. Cool. All right. Nice to yeah. Tyke, we'll see if we can um, make him explode next turn. Your next one. Your red or, or green. Yeah, okay. It's got to be green because it's just going to get in the way. Um, He is navigating. Uh, I don't think he's got, he have an obstructed side. I doubt he's in blue range. Um, uh, he's got no cards, is he? All right. Um, so he's just going the wrong way at the wrong speed. Uh, currently doing three. I've got two. Okay. Right, then my next one. Um, I'll move my flotilla next. Get that a bit closer for its bomber command center. Movement. What was I doing? Speed 2 for that. I should be okay. Now, what range is bomber command center? 1 to 5. Uh, let's slow down to speed. Flotillas won't cause any damage to anyone that rams them, does it? No, except it's not uh, a flotilla. Yeah. Okay, what's one? Move. 
Yeah, I'll slow down to speed one, actually. The last thing I need is my hammerhead killing my own flotilla. Oh, actually, I'm already doing speed one. Oh, well. Just you. Uh, have I got token? I've already got token, so it's wasted. Oh, well. Two. Move. Done. There we go. Right, and your next ship. Look more impressive. It says it's all the coloured ships versus all the standard coloured ships. Yeah. <laughs> um. Good guy. Good guy. Doing a handbrake turn, are we? Maybe. Um, just to follow the leader. work. Next can hassle the yellow at the same time. Um, right, then my last ship. MC seventy five with a squadron command. So rapid launch base. Mm -hmm. There we go. It's over here for a sec. Right, okay. So they launch activated, don't they, I think? They launch. Um, you can launch them. You can attack, but you cannot move with them. Right. Okay. That's going to be fun. This just gets better by the second, really, isn't it? Now, let me just check uh, which one of these squadrons I want there. Definitely the B-Wing squadron. Yep. So only one of them is going to really get into the rear arc, I think. That's a range one. Yep. Well, Luke ignores shields anyway, so let's just put him there. Yep. And... Uh, no, I should be able to get a rear arc right. there. There we go. Yeah, but it's no value in getting moved in the rear, as you say. Right, okay, so. Squadron, I suppose, activate these squadrons first. We'll mm -hmm. do the squadrons first. So we'll do uh, Nora. Hang on, what's John's Nora? Where are we? Oh, no, uh, Kian, sorry. Uh, while well, attacking a ship, if the defending hull zone has no shields, you may reroll any number of dice in your attack pool. Well, so two blacks with rerolls. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Well, I would have had that anyway with the beacon. Uh, no, it's for ships. Oh, yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. Your, um, right. your range ring bands on your ship are way off, aren't they? Oh, there it is. Now it's set properly. Um, you're meant to have the ships within distance one, uh, not at distance one. You've got these two squadrons at distance one, not within. So they have to be fully within? They do, yeah. The card specifically says within, not at. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So My they've, got, they've got to come back a bit, yeah. All right. See, Andrew, yeah, I'm not just against you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, God. Yeah, that's good. To see a bit of, um, right, there we go. A bit of balance. Cool. No, no, I've, yeah. I've learned something as well, so that that's a good. Um, I think I think you still see the rear arc anyway, but it yeah, um, yeah, it, it could have made a difference. Uh, yeah. don't know if I do with the Y wing now, but the B wing will. Yeah, uh, the Y wing has. The Y wing still got it too, but no, it hasn't. I'll just activate it then. No, you're good. You're good. No, no, you're good. You're 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 thinking arc, not line of sight. 
Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. there's a difference between arc and line of sight. Yeah. yeah. You know, I think I've never played this before. God, I'm rusty. Um, right, mate. Right. You, you, you landed your, um, your Redis really well, so it wouldn't be um, too Right, so this is the uh, B-Wing. Right, and I'm going to just re-roll the one, I think. Two hits. Damage, yep. Right. Okay. And... Each free explosion, I didn't roll. That's fine. Right, okay, and then I've got uh, Nora. Mm -hmm. One. Damage. Yep. And then Luke. Yep. We're hitting the crit. And it goes straight through the shields. Uh, you've still got your red guy to shoot, haven't you? Uh, yeah, he hasn't shot yet. Uh, when do you take a contain? You take a contain when you take a contain. Mmm, risk it. Structural, of course it was. That's right. <laughs> At least it's got no long-lasting effects other than the fact you've taken an extra damage. Yeah. Three, so everyone should go. Six, there you go. Six, so, right. Activated. So okay, right. Yep. Oop. Ah. Yep. Cool. All right. right, okay. Now, my red okay. guy. So, let's do the side arc first. Oh, yeah, uh, three red, two blue. Right, so it'll have to be at your uh, side arc then, I guess. So I got something right. to check. That that arc is lining up correctly for you guys seeing it, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, okay, just yeah. on my end, just uh, the viewers will see it as not looking correct. The the arc is oh, right. off center a bit. So I just wanted to make sure it was right for you guys. So cool. Yeah, yep. side to side, is, it's plain as day. Yeah, yeah, the the front arc. I wasn't too sure of the front arc because the it is literally when you watch the replay, you'll see what I'm talking about. The angle is right off, like yeah. about the arcs move like um, about thirty it's, degrees. It's or actually something. side to side and front to side. Yeah, they both got there's it. No, okay, there's cool. no front to rear um, arc. Actually. Oh yeah, I know, I know, I know that. But yeah. both both arcs do it. So, okay, it's just not clear on my end. That's all. So I just want to check. Yeah, this. yeah, that's all yeah. right. Uh, right, so I've got that. Door. Add external racks in here because we've got what have we got? Well, they've got haven't got a hell of a lot in the way of no, you've got no redirects to obtain. Burn that. Yeah, I'll add the external racks in. Mm -hmm. I'll also have at least one ship that uses them. Good. Um, yeah, I'm not going to do any re rolls here, so. Five, six, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'll accuracy your. your contain. Okay. Salvo me if you want. <laughs> um, I'll sell you. I, look, I probably will sell you. Seven. All right. So, um, what I'll get you to do yep. is I'll get you to re-roll the black crit. Okay. This one here. Cool. Okay. One less damage is six. So six. Um, and you basically um, went the contain, yeah? Yep. All right. So this ship's now having its second last turn. So <laughs> well, I still turn haven't done my front part yet. Yeah. Um, all right. So now I have to absorb six, of which one is a crit. So yeah, I may not even make it to the end of the turn. Um, all right. The crit is. Um, okay, yep. Your value for the last adjustable speed is reduced by one. Yep, oh, I'm happy with that. 
<laughs> you don't have much in the way of maneuverability anyway. Another five, the throw, isn't it? Uh, yeah, uh, so you had, yeah, you had so four shields. One, two, three, four, Why are you taking those? Because you just did seven, six damage, right? Yeah, but you've got four shields there. Oh, I'm sorry, you're right. So you only right. take two damage, you'll take that face up and only one card. Yeah, apologies. Yeah, gotta be excited there. That's alright. Got a bit got a bit caught up in my own desperation. Um, <laughs> Woe was me. Let's just, let's just jump on there, see what happens. There we go. Didn't even look at them. Um so we'll take yeah, we'll take so we'll take a table of six. We're taking your right four on the shields. We're taking one face up. That gets that to zero. I thought I was dead. Well, now I'm definitely not dead. All right. So, so what do you want? Seven, seven and eight. I've got six left, and I'm so now still... elbowing you yep. into your beautiful three shield at close range with a black and two reds. Okay. Um, there you go. No mods. Wow. That's what have I got out the front? Two black and three blue. Uh, why don't you just take four off the hell of it? Oh, uh, for the hell of it. <laughs> um, we're just about the end of the turn, so I'll brace it and redirect it. So down to two and redirect where are your ship's currently there and there. Yeah. That was on the side, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so I'll take two on the front. Yep. Right, and then the front arc shot into your side. Yep. Thank God it's... Jesus, this measly fire dice. It would kill me, couldn't it? Right, um... Far out. I would... Oh, I was going to say, I'd like an accuracy there, but I don't really need it. You've got a contain there, but... Do I try... How much damage do I have to do to you to kill you? Um... Exactly that. You've killed me. Oh, I have killed you. Okay, I was going to say, do I need to re-roll? Yeah. Oh, you can stop a face-up damage card, but that's not going to do you any good. No. No, I can't stop that. That's a killing blow. I think one, two, three, four, five, six. I can't get you to re-roll the black. Six plus, that's 13, plus one is 14. That's it. My friend, you have sent it to face dust. Hmm. All right, no, I can't see how that is any result but a kill. Uh, I contain, burn that, uh, which turns it into six cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's seven, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I was hoping to get a shot off, just one shot off on your yellow deck. And I would have thought that would be actually... Um, Enough to kill him, yeah. I would have killed him, but it would have been enough to equal out the points. So now my yeah. vets have to um, pick up the slack. <laughs> and a lot of slack it is. Yeah, it is a lot of slack. All right. Uh, um, he's gone. Gonski. Mm. Yeah. And there was a nice engineering there. Um, but no more. No worries now about um, sending my fighters in to lock up your fighters because <laughs> there's nothing to protect. All right. Um, cool. All right. Squadrons. Um, got two squadrons? Uh, yep, your so, squadrons, yep. Yep. Uh, this guy attack into the side. Uh, one black, one hit. Okay. Right. Yeah, I don't think there's a hell of a lot I can do there. Um, what have I got there? I've got one shield left. I could redirect. Might as well burn the token because there's no shields left after that anyway. Yeah. Nothing on the other okay. side, so I might as well. Yeah. Uh, let's uh. Uh, was it yellow guy? Burn that one. Right, so there's that shield gone. 
All right, there we go. All right, so uh, he will then, if I can remove, doesn't really want to mess with Luke. That's all he can really mess with. So he might move this kind of way, uh, black, black, let's bring it out. Let's go about, let's go close to your, what's, what's the transport doing, what speed? Speed one. Cool, all right. And that's got black flashes as well. Yeah, we'll go about. Oh. There. Uh, oh, thank you, go about. Hang on. You're going to be in black flat range of either of them. Doesn't matter where you go. Yeah, I'd rather stay with um, this guy. He wants to. Oh, sorry. He wants to spend his black flat on me other than the ships. I'm going to do that. Come on, stop it. Only one. Uh, actually, let's go out of arc. We'll go there. Guy. Choices. And here I want black into the side. Okay. For one. Yeah, there's not a lot I can do against that. So what's that down to now? Uh, what have we got there? I need to stack these cards. One. Uh, two, three, four, five. Four left. Why won't these stack? Oh, hang on. Yeah, no, that's all right. Four left. Group. Ah, oh, there we go. Five. Cool. There we go. I should do that there. Uh, let me flick them. That's the end of the turn. And uh, we move to turn four. Far out. Right. Very early in the game. Sorry, very. On, Thank you. Uh, right, okay. Order dials. It's nope. probably not going to shoot anything this turn. Hmm. That there, what have I got, please? Yeah, that's fine. Now that infernal tractor beam out of the way, I can actually go the speed I want to go. <laughs> okay, that, which is going to be handy. Uh, whether he survives to the last turn, I don't know. Right, that. Do. Let's do that. Right, I think I'm good to go. Okay. Uh, Okay, uh, tokens are reset. Um, right, so One, two, actually. Is it blue? That's the one that's got the malfunctioning weapons. Uh, yeah. Okay.
All right, let's just um, start with red. On fire, um, we've got side to side with yellow, and then front to, to rear with the transport. So we'll do side to side on the MC75 first. Yep. Then we're likely to use Confire on that. So we need um, a red and a just a red, isn't it? Um, yep, yeah, just a red. Alright, so roll that. One. Um, left on you know, the price. Um, can, yeah, and no, we'll take the second lead, which is the con fire. Okay. Uh, roll that. I'm going to flip that with, oh, with the um, base yep. and turn that into three. Okie dokie. Uh, that's on MC75. So that's... Let's brace it down to two. Mm -hmm. Is there any criticals or anything there? No. Not much else I can do. Two damage. One. That's what two left. Two. Okay, and your second uh, shot. Out the front, uh, which is basically just uh, two reds into the Corvette. Uh, sorry, is the it obstructed court. from your... Oh, are you going to do, I suppose, to the side so it's unobstructed? Yeah, well, let's have a look. Front to side, wherever we can get a, a line. Line. Okay. Yeah. Is that obstructed? Let's have a look. Uh, one sec, let me magnify there. Uh, uh, look, it's a millimeter type thing. Uh, let me have a look. Is it touching? Uh, yeah, because it's a... Let me go to. Yeah, it's not obstructed. Okay. Yeah, because yeah, obviously, if it's a rear arc, it is. So, okay. You Side actually, arc. You actually, you actually have the full width of the line that you draw. So, if one part of the line isn't obstructed, then you're fine. Oh, yeah. Then the other, I've let go and the line's still there. Yeah, yeah. I see what you mean. I can actually see space between it. Yep, that's cool. Cool. All right. So. Why is that um, not deleting? I could go away. What is that bullshit green line? It's meant to be red lines coming out of the Rebels. What's going on? I can't delete it, it won't let me. <laughs> okay. All right. well, let's just take it as the green mark of death. All right, so yep. uh, two reds. Um, I've burnt my... Oh, hang on, erase all drawn lines. Let me just... This yes, one. there you go. I want you to like that. All right, so I've used my... Um, Concentrate fire, fire, yep. So it's just going to be two reds. If there's a miracle and there's a... The accuracy, well, we'll dance, dance and joy. There's not. So it, scatter, your choice. Just in case something miraculous happens with one of the other ones, I'll just use an evade for that. Sounds sensible to me. Alright, so red is moving at speed 2. Um, okay. Or she. This could be interesting. <laughs> yeah, well, we can kind of thread left or right, and... Um, but can you squiggle enough that you're not going to... Um, he's a squiggle, mate. He's a squiggle by, by definition. Um, one, two. No, like no dramas. Especially if I don't value my um, left shields. No problem at all. Um, do you want to do that? Or do you want to go the other way? He's run out the side. Um, a lot of angry dice. Uh, what's your range? Yeah, oh, it's in. All right, it's only four years in trouble. We'll go to the other side and burn our own shields on. Oh, it's actually just a face up, isn't it? Um, mm, face up. What's the worst that could happen with a face up? Any number of things. Yeah. 
Um, well, I might not get a face up. Might not with that. Ridiculously close to squeezing in. Uh, I yeah. don't know if you will. Uh, you know, I don't think. Are you talking about squeezing into the. No, obviously. In well, you can't. You're on the wrong side. Oh, you can't move from one side, side of the right. template to the other. Yeah, I was right. thinking, what the hell are you talking about? <laughs> no, I wouldn't squeeze in there, would I? But I might. Um, no, you can't overlap it. I can't do that, but I can do that, and I can do. No, I can do that. Uh, no, maybe I just have to. I really don't want to give you a, a false. Oh, he's on full health, isn't he? Yeah. Cut him on muffler. Well, it won't be for if he hits that ship in front of us. <laughs> That's a hot tip. Yeah. My muffler is dead and buried. Um, So you fire pack mods, you don't have the extra movement either. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, you've got no tokens either. What about, if, if you want to stay away from it, what about going that side there, go like that. Oh, why has that gone wonky? No, your back of your ship won't clear it anyway. Uh, it's a matter of just, just do I just take, um, they both take one face down uh, mm -hmm. and stay away from. Yeah. Wait, do I stay away? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Um, <laughs> share the damage each. So you have to reduce it to a speed one manoeuvre. Yeah, I haven't got anything in the car. We're running hot. Mm -hmm. No, I think that's the safest. Let's just take a bank. I've got the bump. So we go like that. See if the, the dials might overlap even still. I do. Alright, so it stays there. Here's the good thing though. Yeah, I know, the stupid red. station. Red's okay, and it just screws over blue. <laughs> Who's already got damage? Yeah, it says, there you go, blue. Sorry about that, mate. But I'm all right. I got took it, but I've come back on myself on the station, I repeat. Blue's taking one for the team. Yeah, it's well done, blue. Well, at least it wasn't a red... I know it's the wrong series, but no, uh, or the wrong um, franchise, but at least it wasn't a red shirt. Yeah. <laughs> right. So that's that. What am I going to move first? Um, those are better move the flotilla out the way first. Yeah. Um, I'll activate the flotilla first. Mm -hmm. Move a command. I think he's going to speed one, isn't he? Yes. So I'm going to. Go speed. Speed three. Can I get out of the way? One. Might use the token and the command to go up to speed three. Mm -hmm. Right. One, two, three. So that. My. Uh, dial, I can do an extra one there. Actually, if I move that other side. One, two. Done. There we go. Okay. Uh, the dial. Um, Alright, it's a blue. Activates. Got. Uh, nav. Um, has he got medium? Yes, he does. does which means but you'll lose one of them. Valid one red attack. Yep. Um, which is all he needs. So he grabs that. 
Um, you roll with that. He TRCs that to a double. Oh, yep. I need to burn that brace. I'm going to have to because otherwise I'm dead. Yep. There you go. He's on a sliver. And he is doing speed four. He's going to um, see where that takes him actually with his navigating. Go on and light the speed ahead. Oh, what happened? That disconnected. We'll see what happens here. So he's connecting up the top. Do I have to do anything? Hang on. Can I bring it back down? No. And the server is here? lost. What do I do? Do I hit join or what do I uh, do? No, nah, go back into create and you'll have to set it all back up again. And we'll have to join in again. All right. Yeah, so just create the server and then we'll just join up again. Cool. Did you want me to create? Because it saves for each person, yeah, doesn't got, it? Oh, he's probably got the better auto save than yourself. So oh, he right. just quickly creates and we join back in. Yeah. I've got the two ships now just appeared. The t like the Onager and the Starhawks on the Ah, cool. Board. Yeah, just delete those. And then just yeah. go to... Um, uh, oh, God, where is it? Um, games up, or something? Up the top, yeah, click Games. It's showing me the standard workshop save. Yeah, right my, right down the bottom. Sh right down should have like auto save. Just click that. Auto save. Yeah. yeah. There we go. We're back. Is it where we were before? It might be like 10 or 20 um, seconds behind, so. Oh, no, that doesn't matter as long as uh, it's not. Back when the Starhawks were on. on. Yeah, so where it is, is it's, take, it's saved prior to Blue having its turn, so its dial is still on its, um, on its um, chip. Yep. And your card count for. Um, it should be up at eight. Yeah. Still on seven. So burn your brace, put in a card, and I'll. Just waiting for it to load. And then we just do the. God, I don't know what they've yeah. done with Tabletop Simulator. It seems to load really slow now. <laughs> yeah, I'm struggling to get into. Yeah. Whatever they've bloody done, they've so when you stuffed it. Back, when you get back, what you have to do is um, add a card to Radis. Yep, and take and away my brace. I need to remove the blue Corvette. And that's, so it's pretty much remembered. Um, bizarrely, though, actually, no, it's... Your transport still hasn't. Yeah, my transport hasn't moved either. Hang on. Move uh, transport. Yeah, so my transport. I uh, will delete the dial. Oh, hang on. Let me take it off. What was it? Oh, it was a maneuver one. one. Maneuver, yeah. Um, Do that maneuver. One, two, three, and I went one like that with the. Nav command, one there, and then two that way. Move, done. Right, that one's done. Yep. And basically, we yeah. blue had its attack. You took a so, card and you right, took a card. It. Take a card. Is right, right wish. On, or is that I clicked click delete card? on it, but it's still there. Uh, oh. oops. oops, sorry. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, looks like it's gone now. Um, and now I need to do a navigate command on the blue guy who's currently doing uh, speed four. See if he can do it this time. Yeah. Shots anywhere in this place. Uh, the other guys do though. Because he's on his own, he's on two from his own misadventure. Um, and hit with no front shields. How many's got two left as well, hasn't it? Uh, I believe so. Two or three. Oh, it's got two left. 
Yeah. Oh, that's right. I spent that. And I spent that. Move, no, the only thing that's moved is my transport. Yeah, right. okay. um... Doing. Is that even legal move? Sorry? I don't think it's a legal move, actually. Yeah, I was going to say, weren't you going faster than that? <laughs> yeah, I, I just did a speed 2 manoeuvre, but I'm actually doing speed 3 now. If I decelerate, so I have to add one more in. Yeah, that'll do. Right. Alright. Next one, okay. Um, he should be out of range, so he should be safe for now. Let's do. Let's do the hammerhead. And it's a firepower. Yep. So a blue and a red out the front, and I'll probably add another red, and I would say. Let's just roll one of each first. Into your front shield or front hull. Mm -hmm. And I'll add in a red for my firepower. Yep. Three damage and let's accuracy. Which one's that? That's the blue one. Yep. Uh, what range are we at? Medium. So you can cancel a dice with an evade, can't you? Yeah. You can only spend... Oh, you can... Yeah, I'm pretty you sure... Can you can only spend... Yeah. You, know, you can't you spend two evade in a turn, evade. can you? Sorry? You can't spend two evade in a turn, can you? No, no, no way. No. Um, All I end up doing is taking one damage regardless of what you do. Stop the redirect. can't... Through if I stop and evade, yeah. Oh, I'll stop the redirect, yeah. It's not gonna matter. Smart, smart thing to do. I'll flip that, I'll get rid of the double, I'll take one as a damage card face, uh, face down. Yep. Right, I don't think there's anything else range wise I can shoot. No. Right, so he was doing speed two. I can't seem to look, delete anything anymore. I usually just hit delete on them and they disappear. Right. Uh, let's go. One, two. Actually, can I hit you? No. You can hit the, you can hit the transport if you want that. Oops. No, that's not what I want. Let's go. What's with this bloody manoeuvre tool? It seems to go wonky. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. That's better. Well, if I do that, you double arc me. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Really? And I fit through there. I'm not sure if I'm going to bump my transport. Yeah, I think you will. Yeah. So. Actually, no, I'm not. Oh, the, the shield dial might. Yeah, probably. So, I'm here, shield dial. Yeah, I'd say that would hit. So, let's go. Yeah. I suppose that's the best I can do. Move. Yeah, yeah double arc. Uh, did you also get right. in range? Oh. 
No. All right, your next one. Mm. It's the maximum carnage move from Blue. Next turn. Um, all right. Yeah, and he's the one with the weapons damage. Yeah. Um, or damaged munitions, which yeah. seems odd because technically they fire lasers. There is no munitions. Well, I suppose there's energy cells or something. Yeah. All right. Well, interestingly, our friend here can actually dispense justice. Bugger, I actually, I, I actually thought he was out of range. No, he is going to kill it, because he can, actually, and he's unstoppable. Um, don't even have to burn the confire. Which I'll, means I'll bank it. Um, green. Okay. Um, the way all my yeah. ships were, I couldn't have moved him because he was crashed into the back of my other ship yeah. and killed himself. I couldn't move the red one first. In the words of the doors, come on, baby, light my fire. Um, all right, so it's going to be... Um, Oops, sorry, flipped the table. <laughs> so it's going to be uh, a single red. Yep. Out the right, which is just basically side to side. See if we can naturally roll one out of one one v eight chance of doing it without the card. Roll a blank just to make me happy. That's a crit, but rather than do that, we will red. What crit? You don't want to do a face up damage to me? To, is the final act? No. Right, you know I'd contain it just to spite yeah, exactly. it. <laughs> <laughs> It only has one hole left anyway, doesn't it? So it doesn't really matter. Yeah, yeah, I know. He's just rubbing salt. I think he saw him as Starhawk. Oh, yeah, there's one, right? You're right, it's got one. Yeah, I know. Can't seem to pick. There we go. So, that's. Oh, yeah. No, we didn't. Yeah, we just took those a token, and now that's moving at B. Yeah, I can't seem to delete anything at the moment, so I was going to drag it off the table. Can I delete that? Actually, do you have to promote me again? Uh, okay, let me do that. Maybe that's why you can't delete anything. Yeah. Yeah, now I can get rid of things a lot easier. <laughs> Thinking, why can't okay. I delete anything? So we've both lost our admirals. The only difference is my admiral doesn't matter once I drop my ships in, so... Yeah, true. Oh, yeah. I'd probably take the points, though. So what's going on with this bloody manoeuvre dial? One, one, two. There we go, that's better. One, that's all we have to do. No, 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 you, you had the right course before. <laughs> Right, that's an odd manoeuvre. <laughs> I think that was a right manoeuvre. Nah, the dial might... No, what is that about? Um, I might put... I might put my dial over the... Can't really work out whether that dial is going to go over the asteroid. What's the blue the green sitting on? Clean. Um, I'm only doing two. That potentially is clear. Potentially is clear. The dials will be clear. Will the rear be clear? I think that is less dangerous. Than, than that. I think the dial will definitely be over that way. That the dial might be over. I'm not sure. Let's do that. Seems a bit naff, but let's do it. Oh, oh. we did. Oh, God. 
Is that like, is that on? Yeah. I can't see with your hand there. That's not my hand, that's someone else's hand. No, it's clear. Just. Yeah. He threads it through the needle, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> if your ship had gone in for that sh scheduled repaint when it was meant to, it would have hit that. <laughs> There's a whole... Down the side of that green ship is a massive big rock scrape. Mm. Gravel rash. That's it. Uh, wow. Okay. Fight on. Spikes on. So that's all the ships, isn't it? Um, uh, no, I've still got my red ship to go. All right. Yep. It's got a squadrons or a confire or what is it? It is squadrons. Oh, bugger. <laughs> well, it's only, it's only like the rest of the play heavy, aren't they? No, yeah. No, uh, no, no, I'm heavy. That's all right. Enter it right. in peril. Move. Uh, right, so let's go. B wing's not going to make it that far. Actually, which one's got the better, better anti squad? Luke does. Five hole, six hole, five hole, yeah. You want to have counter the no, they just got rogue. Yeah, no, they haven't got counter. They're just they're just basically a, they're like a a wild wing of attitude, basically. Mm. No, I'm gonna do Luke's Luke there. Okay. First done and then attack. Could have actually been further back. Done. Are you in range of you are of the token? Right, so let's do was it just one black for him? Is it Oh yes, yes, yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, sorry. Right, let's see what it gets. Ah, oh, bugger it. <laughs> he forgets to use the force. Yes. Uh right, next squadron. Just gonna have to cruise. I'd say that's probably as far as I can get. Mm -hmm. Done, and I don't think I'm in attack range. No. no. Okay. Done. So it's okay. those two. Then. Um, why okay. won't. Oh, that's number three. Just hang back for a sec. Yep. Put him back. Go oh, Oh no, you went squadrons. Apologies, you went squadrons. Yeah, yeah. You got three? Yeah, squadron activation three. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to launch the three in the first place. Yeah, true. Well spotted. Uh, right, so why are we into your um, transport? I'll attack the front arc there. Uh, uh, I'm be nervous. Uh, was it just a black? Yeah, well, at least I've got a. Where are you going? Front or side? Uh, Kind of matters because it's um, Nora. Oh, yeah. Um, oops. Because uh, what does Nora do with Bomber? Again, defending holes and loses a shield. So I effectively could deplete the side shield if I hit it. But if I do the front, you're not going to lose a shield, but you could redirect around to the other side. Well, you will redirect around the other side to stop it. How much health has that got left? Two. One. No, it's got... Oh, you got three cards there? No, it's got one. Oh, yeah. Apologies. So you will redirect. So, no, I'll fire at your, your side arc with two shields, actually. Okay. Just one damage. Uh... Mm -hmm. I'm going to re redirect that even still. Um, yeah. I'm re okay. Anyway, one turn away. Then my MC seventy five will fire. Mm -hmm. Long range with three red dice there. Do what the squadrons couldn't. Well, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Out there. Three 
three damage with an accuracy, so we're at long range. Um, that's. Oh, I think that's a kill. Because I'll. No, it's, not a, it's, not a kill. it's really close to a kill, but it's not quite. Well, I'm hitting. Oh, actually. Yeah, I said the side, didn't I? So I'm hitting the side. Um, Basically, I burn a brace and um, I survive. Or well, burn a redirect, you mean? Yeah. Well, at least I target it. Doesn't matter. I've got two redirects, so I'm going to cancel the double. Doesn't matter what you do. Two evades. Yeah, two evades, sorry. The evade will cancel, cancel the double. Cancel the double, double yeah. And um, you can decide whether I burn my green evade or my red evade. That's, you know. Well, no, I was so thinking if I accuracy the redirect. It's no point uh, because I, there's no value in redirecting. So your best option is to accuracy my green evade, I burn my red evade, I burn the two, and then I take one in the in the shield and then we just move on. Yeah. I should have targeted the front hole zone in the first place. Yeah, yeah, anyway, um, yep, we'll do that. Front hole zone and I had a potential to redirect to the other yeah, side. Yeah, but then I'd accuracy the redirect, but I, I said into your side initially, I didn't think about it. Yeah, all right. Yeah, so anyway. you are targeting... Oh, target the green evade. The green evade? Yeah, the green evade, the, red ev the green evade. Yeah. Yeah, so I have to burn the red evade. Yep. I uh, I redirect has no point, and that get the, the, basically I get rid of that, and then I have to take one into the shield, and that goes to one. Yep. And then you move, unless you've got another shot. You've got another shot, haven't you? Um, all that rear. You've got a, you've got a double arc. I suppose. On the, uh, on yeah, the, so uh, a red and a black, a uh, red and a blue, uh, a black and a blue. Yep. Two. Two damage. Bloody CR90 is bloody resilient. Mm. Yeah, he's refuses to go down without a fight. Right, uh, so it's him um, um, and then it's just your squadrons. Let's move the red dude first. So your red dude's got to move speed two somewhere. Yep. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay. Now over to my squadrons. Uh, hmm. Yeah, okay. Cavalier, how Cavalier do we feel? Um, so Luke's got Escort. Luke's got five hull and he's got no, he's got two braces. Um, do we gang up on Luke? Just hit him with everything. It's worth 20 points. Mm. Just gonna get in the way, isn't it? Let's just do it. Let's just let's just get angry at Luke. Um Okay, work with four blue. Okay. Uh, so it's gonna be it's gonna be two damage. Yeah, well it'll be one, won't it? 
Well, you got two hits. And one, one. Oh, so you yeah, one damage. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I was gonna say you could. Do, yeah. Let's so say I'll flip one of the untargeted braces and take yeah. one. Damage. Yeah. Okay. <sighs> Time for one again. And I'll do that. Okay. And that's the turn. That's all she wrote. That was turn four. That was a pretty epic turn. Hmm. Turn five. I feel these next couple of turns will go a hell of a lot more quickly now. Yeah. Um, right. Dials and reset tokens. Three, two, and three. Uh, yep, reset, please. So, how much is, um, how many's got two left, right? Yep. And what's he's got on, in terms of tokens he's got? Basically right. just redirects and, um... That. That's that. Got two. That's that. So he's got... Right, I'm all good to go. Right to contain, he's got two health. He's at <sighs> short range, and he's double art. Alright, I've got bloody TRCs. Alright, I think I know what the answer is there. Um, so I think it was these dials which we have turned all like that. Um, oh. Red is going B2. Uh, A. And green is two. All right. All right, the end game. Yes. Right, happy you got your, shit, your stuff done. Uh, yep. Roll that card around. Got your tokens reset. I think I've got everything reset that I can use. Yep. All right, let's do it. Uh, Friday night shenanigans. All right, Mr. Blue is going to reveal his style. How surprising. Um, it's a navigate. Okay, so um, wasn't expecting that, but okay. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, I it, it would have been a con fire, but that would have been silly because I don't need to overkill. Um, so I'm going to go. You're confident of not rolling blanks, but okay. <laughs> well, I suppose you got yeah turbo lasers, don't you? you got yeah, turbo lasers. I need to get two, and you cannot redirect it. You can't stop it. All you can do is contain a crit that. The TRC kills you with one shot because um, it's that close range. And you, well, you guess you can redirect it. You've got one shield to redirect. Um, so I might take two shots. I will take two shots, actually, unless I use my front shot. We'll see. I've got a red and a blue. Red, so, yep. This could potentially kill it. If I roll three, basically. Yep. Now I've got to take my chances out the front with the um, transport. All right. Isn't that the ship that has the reduced? Oh, you're true. It's true. Yeah, let's get rid of it. Yeah, but right, let's delete that. Yeah, thank you for calling that out. I've only got I one thought you were firing out your front arc then, or was that your side arc? That's my side arc. Oh, right. I see. All right. Let's just take that back. 
All right, so my side arc. Hmm. My side arc should probably. So my side arc can't actually be used for anything else. Oh, it could be used for flak actually. Actually, that's a point. We can do a blue flak out the side on all of those. We'll put a blue flak in the loop. All right, so let's just do red out the front then. Let's leave the transport alone. All right, so, so it's two red out the front, is it? Red and a blue, and it's out the front. So okay. Now, now, now we've just got to work out whether I need to use another blue out. This. Mm, yeah, okay. There's an element of risk now. Um, other than a ram. Um, all right. Cool. That's good enough. So all we need to do now at the front is not use the confire. We, well, you, you had a navigate. You never confire. Oh, you mean token? I don't have a sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm getting myself tidy knots here. I don't have a confire. I have an. I basically a red and a blue hit, which is great because I don't have a blue accuracy. I'll also be screwed. Um. So. Uh, so if I change that to two, you've got two left. You can redirect one, and then you have to take two, and that kills you. So um, I basically blue flip that. And turn that to that, and say to the, the hammerhead, take three. Well, I take two, so I took one on the shield and then two cards. Yeah. Which is death. All right. So I'm left with a side shot, which is simply... Now, that, does that card say all attacks or just ship attacks? Let's have a look. Because if it's all attacks, it's some... Um, We're attacking a ship before you roll. No, so it's not attacking a squadron. So I can still do one blue out the side at all of the squadrons. And then what I'm really concerned about is the one with Luke. So one uh, fifty percent chance of him for one. Right, so against Luke. Nothing. nothing. Of course. Against the Y Wing. So just for giggles, nothing. Nothing. Kian. For one. Yes. Actually might have actually yep. be more um oh. important. Right, now uh, I'm navigating. I'm currently doing Speed three. three. So let's see what speed four looks like. Uh, right. Okay. Hold on. So Dawson with death. How many blue out the red out the front? You got one, two. Potentially invade one of those. Um, what can we do? I've done that. We can do that. We can do. All right. Hang on, how many turns are you doing at your first manoeuvre notch? Uh, I'm doing manoeuvre, so I'm pushing one extra, right? So Yeah, but you, you, can, you can't do one at speed four in the first place. Yeah, there you go, that's better. All right. Yeah, apologies. So you're, you're, you're gapping it. <laughs> best I possibly can. And I'm still going to get the right red range at the back. Oh, that was a no no. No two rulers at the same time. Say what? You can't turn his oh, range okay. band on. So you're pretty much locked to that now. <laughs> Alright, can I do that? I'll let you in on a I'll let you in on a little secret. I don't have red dice out the front. Oh, I okay. wasn't gonna tell him that. <laughs> <laughs> to make him sweat a bit. Black. 
It's blue and black at the front. It's red and blue outside. I'm, I'm, I'm blissfully happy with that, to be honest. I think the other variant is red and black out all the sizes. There's one blue or yeah. something. This is a selective guide. Sometimes he says, hey, what about the free root rolls? And other times he says, those dice aren't actually red. <laughs> <laughs> well, like on the hammer here, it looks like a it's... He's a benevolent guide. He's a bit like Loki, isn't he? He's a bit mm. random. Well, you look like on the hammer here that looks like the little dots are black and blue, but there's actually a red one in there. Yeah. All right. Uh, okay. So we'll burn that. We'll move that. That was turn five. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. He runs to live another day. I suppose I'll move my transport, allow these guys to get closer before I do my big ship. Alright. So, the maneuver command. So, I'm doing speed 3 at the moment. I'll bank the. Oh, I've already got a token actually. No, I'll leave it at speed 3 for now because I can. So uh, doing one more turn. So one, two, three. Oh, the other side. Let's just go like that. Well, I thought you guys were already on turn six. You're only on turn five. Um, no, no, it was like turn three was lethal. It was the Redis bomb that just blew the whole game up? Turn six is going to be very non-eventful, I think, unless um, our uh, red friend's got a lot of fighters and there's a lot of action, but otherwise nothing's really going to happen. Um, yep, yeah. is that him done? Uh, yes, yeah, sorry. Yep, all right, we'll flip this guy. Uh, he's got an av. Um, he's got range on loot with black. What did Luke ever do to you? Nothing, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> he's finally using the force. Yes, he's used the force. Uh, I've got nav. Uh, I'm doing two, so I guess I dropped to one. And I'm just going to. Right. And the other yeah. is red, right? Yep. And... So you squadron command. Yeah, wouldn't that be nice? It's not. It's navigation, pretty sure. Um, we thought we were going to go for a tail chase, but maybe we just lost interest now. Hang on, didn't you just do your... You just did your green one, didn't you? Yes. Yeah, now I'm doing my red one. Why are you oh, doing oh, your... Please. There you go. There's, there's navigation. <laughs> I, I, I was sort of wondering what was going to happen. I would have been expecting it anyway. I mean, it's hardly going to be anything else. Um, right, so squadrons. I think Luke is out of range because it's uh, short to medium, isn't it? Yeah. So Luke's out of range for activation, but that's fine. Um, Nora and. Um, mm, need to kill that bloody CR19 down my wire wing. Oh, <laughs> Wiring's the fastest, so let's go. Yeah. Move. Yeah, not even close. <laughs> and turn six, he runs, so it, it won't happen. You don't reckon that's attack range? No, no I don't think it is, yeah. Oh, well, looks like this uh, poor CR90 is the one. Oh, no, I can't because your fighters, I'll be engaged with yeah, them, won't I? You can just engage at two, three red dice into a couple of guys who will flack you and then shoot you back. Mm. Including a red one, so that's pretty even, dead. I'd have to go. Yeah, yeah I don't know. Oh, but they have, none of those have taken any damage yet, have they? One has. Uh, oh, that one. Yeah, okay. Might as well attack that one then. He's got with four. Let's go about there. Should do. Sure. Done. Let's make sure I am attack range. Yep. Yep. 
Right, okay, how many dice do I have for the Y Wing? Three blue. Yep. That's an eight. Two damage. Alright. Oh, actually, am I in range of. No, not quite. <laughs> <laughs> the beacons don't work. No, bomb a command center from my um. It's not. A, you can't bomb a squadron. Is it only when attacking ships, or is it just bombers? Yeah, only attacking ships. Oh, attacking ships. Sorry, I thought it was just bombers could re-roll a dice. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah I don't use squadrons a hell of a lot. <laughs> yeah, no, it's it's all this game's a mystery, mate. It's layers. It's like an onion. Mm. Make sure, out. yeah, yeah. Makes you cry a lot. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Um. Sorry. So that's that, and then I might as well do the uh, B wing as well. Mm -hmm. There. Done. And the B wing's got three blue also. Wow. This could be kind of um nasty. Two. Nasty enough. No, well played, sir. Thank you. All right. That's increased Luke's survival options significantly, I think. All right, okay. Um, my big ship. I don't think I had any shots anywhere. No, I... No. no you so do I have any tokens? Bent? No. All right, so we're doing speed... What was I doing? Speed one for that, wasn't it? Oh, no, speed two. Right, okay, so let's go. Two. A stupid thing. Why is that not? There we go. I don't know if I'm going to clear my ship, actually. That'd be helpful. Mm. Not really. Right. Oops. Like whole left, right? Sorry? Has it been hit already or not? No, I don't think you. You've only fired one shot at it, and I evaded it. Collided with something earlier. Um, I'll do the other one. I'll do that side. That should work. Let's get rid of these bloody range rules. Base won't fit now, I think. So that's two. I can't do that and. Yeah, we can't do that, obviously, so let's go and move. Yeah, you're oh, yeah, yeah, of course. So you're going to have to go to the other side and just deal with whatever it gives you, which is probably a collide, yeah. Bugger, and it um, is okay. just the shield tokens, but yeah, okay, so I've got to go undo. And then just go forward one. Yep. Yep, there you go. Yeah. Well, at least my MC-75 doesn't take any damage. It does right. uh, outside range as well there. Okay. Hmm. All right. Single shot on that. Oh, we've both done it. Then we've both crashed into our own ships. Yeah. I, I was pretty happy the way Blue took one. Quite happy with that. In fact that um, Red and we haven't done that, right? Very lucky that yeah. wasn't the thing that got him killed. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So Red will just move within flak range. I think he's completely healthy, isn't he? These guys are probably now outside squadron range. Squadron range is that one, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're high and dry and waiting to die. In the words of Top Gun. Um, to be navigation. Um, let's just put themselves in the flat bowl. Um, rude. Got speed two. It's got navigation. Two, three, one, two, three, four. Lunge. Ah, oh, no, it's legal. Locked in. Um, no. How many notches are you doing on the first one? You can't do two on the first one at speed. Yeah, but you have no no navigation at the first speed. You can only do one. Uh, apologies. All right. Undo. Thank you. Do you know the little green um, boxes there tell you how many you've got at each speed for the ship? Oh, okay. Thank you. 
Uh, all right. So it's speed three. I don't even need to do speed three. I could probably just do speed two. Or speed four. I don't know if you can clear it. Actually, speed four, though. I'm actually doing two. So oh, I'm right. I see what you mean. Um, uh, two. Well, I don't mean it. Mind if you go to speed four, I'll give it to you. Yeah. <laughs> Come closer. We're all friends here. Excellent. Um, okay. So let's just go back to three and get less aggressive. Doesn't really matter. It. As, I, as I say, fr fr friendship's like wetting your pants. Everyone can see it, but only you can feel its warmth. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bizarre <laughs> thing, mate. Well, I am so glad that made it onto the uh, recording. <laughs> I'm sorry, yeah. I forgot about that, actually. I want to just open up the travel bubble with New Zealand. <laughs> Friendship apparently is like wetting your pants. <laughs> <laughs> just in a, I think you should just hold on to those guys a bit longer. Lock up's not been that good for their mental health. Yes. No, if anything, we should be allowed out sooner because our mental health is no good. Yeah, clearly. There's a whole bunch of bedwetting going on as far as I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Mm. That is legal. Do you think? Um, yeah, as long as your shield dials don't bloody overlap. Yeah, but I, I think you're okay. Out here. Yeah, you get a, another superstar destroyer in there. All right, so now there's just squadrons left. Yep. And we're engaged with loot. Um, so four blues. This should be hopefully the end of the reign of Skywalker. If not now, then hopefully. At least you roll four accuracies. Yeah, or four there's, crits. There's six more blues to go in the loop before the game's over. Yeah. Take one, Luke. <laughs> yes. That's enough. That's enough. It's almost enough. So, Luke, oh, those, now? those two are actually activated. So, I've still got Luke to act. Oh, um, Have you? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because remember, I didn't activate him. Yeah, true. Oh, you um, anything but shoot back. Right, so Luke is four. Oh, good on you, That's Luke. how you do it. <laughs> oh, you asshole. <laughs> All right, Luke. You, you, you're basically just... Yeah, Luke's just cocky now. All right, that was the end of turn five. All right, yep. let's do this with style. All right. Um, All right, why don't you worry about dials on my one? Oh, well, my transport actually. Let's just do that there. What do you move it? I'm just checking out the tech range. Remember, oh, right. I loop and only loop, which is yeah, no, nah, no, because those two could... I, I only put in range of the other one to begin with. Yeah. I'm hoping he doesn't survive to uh, squadron phase. But anyway, let's see what happens. All right, ready when you are. Right. Um, well, it's your activation first. Hmm. Uh, 
So let's just do blue for the hell of it. What, get him out of the way? Yeah, he's nav. I think he's not range anything. Oh, well, no. you, your, one, your one red dice that you could fire, oh, actually, no, at your side at the transport, yeah. Oh, well, actually, no, one red dice, you, you'd lose it anyway, yeah. It's no, no. He has no shots. Nope. Uh, so he just got his navigation to basically stop him flying off the board. If that was a problem, I have no idea. I doubt it. Aiming straight for the corner, you're not really, even if you turned hard and went straight to the side, I don't think you'd make it. Yeah. Yeah, we just do that. All right, blue. Let's lift for another day. All right. I suppose GR75, do that. Maneuver. And as token, he'll go from. Oh, he's already gone down to. Yeah, yes. So I was going to speed three. What was a. Yes. Just, uh, reset, just reset Luke's some um, brace. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What speed was I doing on my transport? I was doing three, wasn't I? Or just yeah, you're running away from the um, blue guy, so yeah, I think you're... Yeah, I f must have forgotten to change my dial because I'm only on one at the moment. That should be on three. But now I'm going to use the token and dial to go back down to one, so I'm going to delete the token. Yep. Right, and so it's just going to go that. Actually, it's that one. Move. Done. There we go. Right, your next one. Uh, red. Yep. Is flip a, a con fire. Um, and use it with his flak, I suppose. Of course he is. Alright, two blues in the leg. Yep. One. One. Okay. And uh, move two, I think, from memory. Red. Yeah, move two. I'm punching bag. Mm -hmm. Away from the loop. Oh, sorry. Anyway, didn't hit you, Luke. Oh. I was actually hoping you would, so I could deliberately yeah, move from the front of your ship and move them away. <laughs> well, it's and it, it moved. So, but anyway, at the end of the day, good enough. I don't care if. Um, Done. Right. Okay. My uh, ship. It's a squadron command. I sh mm -hmm. should have thought more about my squadron movements when I bloody did that, but yep, they're all out of range, so that amounts to nothing. But I have got some long range shots at your Corvette there. Yep. It's probably the last capital ship shots, ship yep. to ship of the game, probably. So I want three of those. Uh, two and like, what it doesn't like? really matter what I choose. I'll stop the redirect, I suppose. Right. I'll flip a um, obey. I'll obey the crit and take one out of front. Yep. And move. Right, and he was doing, was it speed? Speed two. Beautiful. Uh, okay, so green, last ship move for the game. It's on fire, two blue and a Luke. 
Can he do it? Looking for one hit. Oh, sorry, that's not a roll. That's not on there. <laughs> you can keep that accuracy. <laughs> oh He's no! <laughs> Where's right. Where's Tony Afar when you need gonna roll, it? I'm gonna roll four blue dice and not get a hit now. For him to survive. So we just have to play the odds. He's gonna bump, and red and green are both gonna take a, a card. Dishing out damage in front. Actually, my my MC seventy five is my MC, yeah. There's a way you can sneak around, but I doubt it. Let's have a quick look. Is my MC seventy five is the only ship that hasn't taken any damage. Well, my MC seventy five is the only ship that hasn't taken any cards yet. Good on him. Mm. <laughs> um, that just makes him buddy um a scary cat. <laughs> Um, oh, yes, yes, because yes, dropping it right next to a Starhawk is really being a scary <laughs> cat. Spent <laughs> most of his time loafing around inside of a, you know, hyperspace bubble. All right, mm. now they both take a card. Thank God we're not playing, uh, whatever it is. The one that gives any damage and get points. All right, so it's hit. Right, okay. Now this guy to actually stay in the game. Oh, no, it actually doesn't matter because they can't move and shoot. But he can't survive. Um, Luke's reverse attack. So he either like kills Luke and lives or doesn't kill Luke and dies. And probably dies, yeah. One, two. What are the chances with four blue dice? I don't even want to say it. So you, you've got either crits or, or accuracies that won't do you anything. So yeah. And how many hit hit faces are there on those dice? There's each uh, dice has a four. chance of being a hit. Yeah, so the I chances. Roll one of the shittest rolls in the history of Amada for Luke to live. Drum roll, please. There you go. Oh, you're oh, almost here. <laughs> go ahead, cut it up. close. There you go, he's dead. And just, just to prove he's not a target, he then decides... Oh, sorry, that's not the target. Right? He then decides to uh, make it really clear that he's not available for any kind of um, interference. So uh, I suppose attack, I can attack. Corvette with my uh, B wings just because I can, not that they will yep. do me anything. Yeah, we'll take a trip. Uh, yeah, it doesn't have so it's just too black. No, no re rolls because the shields are intact. Uh, one in the damage in the front, yep, in the front. And the Y wing, I do not think it can do anything. anything. Andrew, how many holes was that, uh, red, was that red um, on. Corvette on? Yeah, sorry? How many holes was that red Corvette on? Uh, uh, three. He's taken one damage, he's got three left. Why is that? Ah, uh, okay, because um, Nora was in range one and shooting the front of only one shield, so if you had have gotten um, two doubles... Nora was out of range. Then, uh, no, Nora was in range Nora. of the B-Wing to give Nora's ability. So if you had have rolled uh, two hit crits... The front would have lost a shield. You would have redirected one to the side. And you would have taken two two damage cards. So if he if you had taken two damage, there was a potential that B wing could have wiped it out. Uh, oh right, I see what you yeah, mean. Yeah, but you weren't on enough. Um, yeah, it, it didn't matter. No, you, 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 had, you only no. took one damage card. That was close. Yeah. <laughs> mm. There you go. So the Corvettes, little red Corvettes, run off. And Bloody um, pesky thing! I think you do a, you did, a, a, I think you get a pretty comprehensive win there, John. Uh, you've done two hundred and twenty-nine points worth of damage. Uh, how much have you done for me? Hang on, let me bring it up. Uh, we're using that one there. Uh, my Radus um, Cruiser is one hundred and forty-eight, and my Hammerhead is. 43. What did you say? Yeah, 229. Hammerhead Luke, and I've got Luke's 20. Hammerhead is what? Um, Hammerhead's 43. Yep. Yeah, and and 148 for my Radish ship. Alright, so it's 11 carry the 1, 10 carry the. So it's, it's actually quite close, actually. It's 211 versus 229. Oh, wow. That was a very narrow one, so they were doing what, what a 5 4, no, uh, a 6 4 or 6 5 or whatever it is. Yeah, well, you know, yeah, 18 points. It's, um, yeah, that was good, but you're, that, um, that would have been a 6 5, pretty much a draw. Um, mm. 
there's your uh, there's your secret with Rattus go hard. But interesting, Magnites um, looked like it was going to be a pointless card, but it actually. Um, well, you slowed me down. I was worried you'd drop me to speed zero, and then all of a sudden smash me with yeah. with everything. So that's why I keep putting navigate commands in there just to make sure that that didn't happen. So. Yeah. And look, it probably for one card, if I had actually um, got one more card, I probably. Well, I maybe. It's interesting. I might have killed the hammerhead and your other MC75 at the beginning of the next round and then exposed your um, transport to three hungry corvettes, which probably yeah. then would have maybe um, tipped it back to an extremely narrow win by me. But it was, yeah, it was, you know, it was down to, yeah, you just had enough cards to kill the, um, the um, basically the starboard, but it was enough. So, you know, you only have to get enough. So it was uh, righty viewers, uh, yeah, that concludes this bat rip. Uh, John versus Andrew. So, John, uh, yeah, getting the uh, 229. What is it? That's uh, so 18 points. So, 18 point win there. But since it's not league, it doesn't matter. Everyone count all points count. So, John will get the 229, and Andrew will get uh, 211 going towards uh, his final score. So, yeah, thanks for tuning in and watching this one, guys. Uh, we should have some more uh, bat rips from the league coming up soon. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, like us on Facebook, and fly casual.